So Otherworld is the Celtic name for fairyland. And so that's sort of been our inspiration. But it's really kind of an homage. A lot of our inspiration has come from the old 1980s fantasy movies that we both really love. So Willow, Legend, Princess Bride, Labyrinth. Um, but we've also got the complexity of stuff like Lord of the Rings in there. We've got a huge world now. With It's a big ensemble piece. There's a lot of characters. There's several kingdoms, um, different cultures, all kinds of stuff. <laughs> We got about 200 years worth of fantasy uh, history going on. We've got several strong female characters. Yes. Um, uh, what I love about it is we've got so many interesting characters. You're not just following one person. You're following um, several of us through this world, and a lot of it centers around um, my character, Princess Isleen, as she's named right now. Although the script is changing all the time. <laughs> But um, you sort of, we start by following her. There's this um, big prophecy that sort of spurs everything into motion, but surrounding her are all these really great characters that I consider to be leading characters as well. Um, your character, Ileana, you want to tell us a little bit about her? Um, I'm not sure exactly how much I can give away. But not very my much. <laughs> my character is, uh, well, we've already slipped that it's fairy world, so um, mine's half and half. She's half elf and she's half human. Um, she has... Uh, very strong tie to both worlds. So she's kind of the, the bridge between mm -hmm. and um, connects a couple of the other characters together. So she's kind of the intermediary, the yeah, and so the that's, hub. <laughs> <laughs> so that's, but that's what's exciting to us is that <clears throat> I feel like this hasn't been done before. I, I am a fairy buff. Um, and I, <laughs> to say the least, and I have always wanted to see a, a movie where you get a real peek into the politics of fairyland and how that goes along with, with the realm of humans and, and what is it like when those two worlds are dramatically split apart but desperately trying to get back together again. And so that's kind of, that's kind of what the, the crux of the series is, you know, how do we unite the worlds again? And I think we can all relate to that now in, in the world with all the division that we have going on. So we just want to, um, you know, we want to inspire people to, to follow their hearts and stay on their journeys. And it's kind of a, um, kind of a coming of age for my character, but it's also um, a journey for everybody involved. It's really kind of, if any of you guys are Joseph Campbell fans, we've got the hero's journey going on pretty serious in this. So, <laughs> or heroine's journey, you know. Yeah. And uh, a lot of magic. A lot of magic. But it doesn't start off very magical. It starts right. off kind of something that you can relate to, and we, we, we pull you in, and you yeah, can't Yeah, we're, we're just going <laughs> to come on in. Um.